What's up? I'm Brian Tong with CNET.com giving you a first look at the all new Sony PS3 Slim. Now Sony's cut the fat and the price to $299 for the PS3 Slim and it will be available worldwide for the first week of September. Cosmetically, you'll notice it's changed to a textured surface that Sony touts as a more casual look. So gone is the shiny black piano finish. You'll also see the logo branding is right here and the fact that the buttons on the unit are now physical buttons that you have to press in. They're no longer touch sensitive. Now the PS3 Slim is loaded with a 120 gig hard drive. It's still bringing Blu-ray for movies and gaming. You'll have built-in Wi-Fi and the two USB ports in the front. You'll also have easier access to the hard drive that's user upgradable without voiding the warranty because Sony's placed it on the front side now. On the back side, you'll see the same connections as before. There's an ethernet port, an HDMI video port, digital audio out, and Sony's AV cable connection for component or composite video out. You'll also notice they no longer have that physical power switch on the back of the PS3 Slim. Now side by side with the previous PS3, the new Slim is 32% thinner, 36% lighter, and consumes 34% less power than the previous model. Out of the box, the Slim is only designed to be used laying flat, but Sony will offer an additional stand for $24 if you want to prop it up vertically. There are a few things the new PS3 Slim doesn't have. There's still no IR port to use universal remotes with it. There's no backwards compatibility, so you won't be able to play the PS2 games on the Slim. And Sony has also removed the capability to install another operating system on it like Linux. But really, no one has complained about the price drop to $299. The PS3 is still rated one of CNET's best Blu-ray players. Then you add in its gaming and its multimedia capabilities, and Sony's really made a real slimmer and lower priced product while keeping the same core feature set intact. I'm Brian Tong with CNET.com and there's your first look at the Sony PS3 Slim.